Here you see the main window of the color vision recorder. On the left you find the patient database. You can simply add a patient by clicking on the Add New Patient button. With each patient, a series of previous color vision examinations is associated. After an examination has been selected, it can be opened to view or edit the test results. To perform or score a new color vision examination, first verify if the correct patient is selected. Next, select the eye or eyes to be tested. Select if you want to do an actual color vision test with the computer or just want to use the software for scoring only. And finally, choose the color vision test to be run. The caps need to be ordered according to color, starting with the reference cap. By clicking on the cap, it will be moved to the next available position in the color order. It is also possible to drag a cap. Dragging caps is usually done to make some final adjustments. In the Farnsworth Munsell 100 Hue test, it is also possible to right click on the cap to position the cap in the next available position on the right side. After all colors are ordered, click the Finished button. And the results of the test will be shown. In the results window, you can still change the cap order. Holding down the right mouse button and moving over the cap is the same as clicking on the cap. This may be used to speed up entering external data of normal or near normal subjects. The results window contains information such as the date, time, eye tested, and duration of the examination. Clicking on most data allows you to change it. There is also a box to enter additional information about the test. For D15 tests, the software shows the well known horseshoe diagram. It also calculates color confusion data based on the Bowman method and on the Thingris King Smith method. At the top, the physician can make a final diagnosis of the test by clicking on the buttons. By default, the program gives a suggestion of the diagnosis based on the amount and direction of the large and small errors in the horseshoe diagram. All color vision test results of the patient are shown again in the lower right corner. This allows for easy comparison between different examinations. In this example, you can see that the patient passes the Farnsworth test, but fails the Lanthony test in the Dutton direction. This indicates that the patient has a mild Dutton color deficiency. A Farnsworth Munsell 100U test result looks similar to that of the D15 test results. Now there are four boxes with cap orders. The analysis includes total error scores, and the diagram is the polar graph of the error scores. By clicking on the graph or the View Plus Plus button, the graph expands. With the Options button, you can further an analyze the graph. Of course, you can also print the results. You viewed a brief demonstration of the Color Vision Recorder software. Thank you for your attention.